Hey guys, Sierra McVeigh here, hanging out with one of the stars of Chasing Life, Haley Ram. How are you? I'm good, how are you? I'm good, I'm excited to chat good. with you. Oh good, me too. <laughs> so season two is coming up. Yes. What are you most looking forward to with this season? Um, I am most looking forward to all of the characters just coming into their own and all of the fun that is going to be had. There's two ways that you can go with it. You can um, choose to be sad and um, kind of get stuck in a funk or mm -hmm. you can look on the bright side and have a, a glass half full you know type of mentality yeah. about it and that's definitely what this is about there's just a lot of fun there's the wedding um that we are about to film really? which is so exciting um yeah i've been like going to bridesmaids fittings like i kind of feel like i'm actually a part of a <laughs> wedding yeah um yeah i'll probably cry or something <laughs> um so yeah that's exciting yeah. and there's a lot going on with brenna mm -hmm. um she has to switch from private school to public school okay. because of all of the medical bills, mm -hmm. um, which in the beginning I think she thinks is like the end of the world yeah. because she's 17, um, but it gets better mm -hmm. and it's actually going to be a really good thing for her. Oh, she's good. dating again. Oh, nice. Um, yeah, she's uh, <laughs> she's back in the game. Well, I got some <laughs> questions about Brenna's dating life, okay. by the way. First, I want to know, is there any update with Career at all? Will we be seeing any of them kind of? Um, to be determined. Okay. I think. Yeah. Um, yeah, I know that they, they did talk about doing something with that. Mm -hmm. um, our characters are still on very good terms. Yeah. Um, there is a point in episode three where I'm emailing her because okay. she's my friend. Yeah. And I love her. I think mm -hmm. I'm always going to love her. Absolutely. Um, yeah, so no Greer yet. Okay. But that doesn't mean that there's no Greer at all. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> and then what about, so we saw something in the finale, kind of like a little Brenna and Finn having mm -hmm. like a passing moment. Mm -hmm. Where was, was that kind of foreshadowing into something? Is that a possible relationship? Or also we don't really know who Finn's bone marrow Yes, you is. don't know. Yeah. Um, but but Finn will be around a lot this yeah. season. We actually just started filming all of that. Okay. And it's been really fun. Finn. <laughs> He will be there. Okay. <laughs> okay. Amazing. I can tell you're trying not to give too much away, but you're trying to give something. Yeah, I think, yeah, they're um, going to have a really cool relationship. I've I've heard a few things mm -hmm. of where that's going and okay. I love it. I'm I'm a, oh, a Finn fan. Nice. <laughs> yeah. And then so is there maybe a certain moment or episode that you're excited for fans to see this season? Um, yeah, episode three, I think I'm really excited about because mm -hmm. um, it touches on Brenna's thoughts and feelings. You never really hear her point of view mm -hmm. um, or, you know, what she's feeling going through all of this. And it's the episode where you do. And mm -hmm. there's a big sisterly fight with all of the sisters. Oh, but man. in the end, it, it's all OK. Mm -hmm. I think things need to be said and um, things need to be addressed about Brenna. Like she dropped the abortion bombshell mm -hmm. in episode 15. So we touch on that a little bit. Okay. Um, so I'm super excited about that yeah. episode. Um, there's a really cool voiceover part um, that opens it. Nice. Um, just, yeah, her talking about her and, and how it's always been living with April, yeah. what that's been like. Well, it sounds like Brenna's got some big things co coming up this season for yeah, her, which is really exciting. Does. I'm very excited yeah. about it. Must yeah. be very cool for you to be able to play all of that out. That's so amazing. much fun. I'm never bored. Yeah. <laughs> and then last question. One thing I love is you guys as a cast, you guys seem so close, like mm -hmm. such a tight-knit family. What was maybe your first impressions of everybody when you first started working with them? Oh, my first impressions. Um, I met Italia at the table read, mm -hmm. and I thought, wow, she's really put together. Um, <laughs> <laughs> very pretty, very organized yeah. um very sweet mm -hmm. um Aisha I thought she's gonna be really fun yeah <laughs> and a little wacky in the best <laughs> way possible and um Richie is just he's such a like a heartfelt goofy guy yeah he's so sweet and then can like be so sarcastic and goofy and just so much fun I remember there was one day where we went to the Boston um Museum of Modern Art, mm -hmm. and I was with Aisha and Richie and Richie's girlfriend, so it was me and all of the Australians, and there's <laughs> something about Australians. They are so fun. Oh, yeah. 
I they know, know how to live life. They for do. Sure. They do for sure. Mm-hmm. They're so spontaneous and fun and just like funny. Good energies. Good energy. Good, energies, good personalities. Sure. Yeah. Yeah. Awesome. So. Well, thank you so much for chatting with us. Thank it was you. nice to meet you. It's nice to meet you too. And you guys, for more on Chasing Life, make sure you head to hollywire.com and hollywire TV. See you later.